Hello and welcome to my channel. Well, I've got a collective haul of some different things to share with you. Um, so I'm going to jump right in. first one is from the Dollar Tree. So I found these glass um, containers and they are glass, they're not plastic. So I bought some of these. I thought these would be really great to um, say mix up some um, uh, sequin mix and, and put them in these. You could actually give them away as well, but um, I thought I would mix up some of different colors and then all I'd have to do is just dump it into my um, shakers. They also had this size. I did pick up some. Um, I didn't pick up as many. I only picked up, I think, three of these, but um, I know they'll come in handy for something, so I'm really glad to find those. I picked up some of this uh, tube confetti. Isn't that a beautiful color? And some of this. Picked up one. Home. They only had one left of these um, hearts. Um, I like to use them for all different things, not just the hearts. You know, you can actually uh, die cut here. And then if you're going to put something on top of it, you can still use the heart even after you've die cut. You know, just... Uh, put something else over the top, another heart or something over the top of that. Uh, I got some new glasses. Not yet, they're still being made, but so I found this and I thought that would be really pretty to put my glasses in. And got me a red Sharpie fine point marker. I use these actually to for my word dies. What I do is I cut the word die out, and a lot of times you can't tell what it is. I actually write the, what it is on the back with a permanent red uh, marker, and um, that way I don't have to constantly cut it out to see what it is. It just is right there for me, and I picked up one of these. Um, I thought I needed something like this color for fall and Halloween. And it's, uh, they have all kinds of colors now. This one is, it's um, like yarn, but I'm going to use it like uh, uh, that stuff, you know, twine. So that's, oh, and I picked up one, I think I bought these. No, I didn't. I bought these at Hobby Lobby. Okay, so that's what I bought, got at the dollar store. That over there. Then at Hobby Lobby, I got a package of these. I thought they were super cute, and um, they can be used on so many different things. Even though I know I can make them, I thought it would be nice to just have them on hand. I also picked up just a few stickers. You know, they had everything paper studio half off so those are my favorite times to go that and when they've got all the trim at half half off half off is a nice price <laughs> so I found these and I love these I love 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 them and these beautiful flowers and my oldest daughter or oldest granddaughter is graduating this year so I got that to put on a card I found these beautiful heart stickers, super sparkly, which I love. I also found these gorgeous birds. Um, this is a package of girls that I don't have in my stash, so I thought I'd just pick those up. Got a couple of Easter, super cute, and another Easter. So very excited about that. Then I got some um, word stickers to um, put in the inside of cards. They're all spiritual. So I was very happy with that. Then, of course, they had all their paper, specialty paper, at um, half, was it half price or... Gosh, I can't remember now. Um, but when I say specialty paper, um, this was not. This is always um, four for a dollar. And um, so I love the different patterns. 
it's nice to be able to pick out certain things that you know that you'll use. I thought those are beautiful Easter colors, and I always love sky um, papers, so I got that at Hobby Lobby. And this, this was what I was so excited about because white glitter cardstock is so hard to find that is in that's that's good quality and this is super super good quality so I actually got 20 of those because um, I use them not just at Christmas time but year round and black is the other one that I have a difficult time um, you know finding at a good price that is from Hobby Lobby then at Tuesday morning I picked up I picked up this sticker pack. It's all fall. There's actually, these are all the stickers that are in there. Isn't that cool? Um, it's their 12 by 12s, but there's 10 different um, patterns in there. So I love that. Picked up this one, and this one is Summer Fun. And these are by Echo Park. So I got this one, and this is what it's got. I don't normally buy a lot of, of flat type stickers. I only usually buy the ones that are, um, you know, um, raised up. You know what I'm saying. This one is called The Great Outdoors, and I loved it, loved it, loved it. So, a lot of fun things to work with on that. Then I picked up a couple of um, other paper packs. This is an Echo Park. This is Hello Easter. It's probably not their new one, I'm sure. Um, but here's the stickers that are in it. And then it has some different papers and stuff. So I got that. And then I have grandsons, lots of them. And so I picked up this authentic collection called All Star. And um, most of them play soccer. So I got that. So that's my little haul. I actually did buy some card bases at, um, at, um, Hobby Lobby as well. They came with the card bases and the, and the envelopes. I actually bought some five by sevens and um, some four and a half by five and a half, uh, four and a quarter by five and a half ones, some A2 um, as well because they were all half price. And um, if anybody's like me, uh, I don't cut that well. And I, for some reason, my cards always kind of like off wonky. So uh, anyway. Well, thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you're having a blessed week, and I will see you in my next video.